This is Dr. Ron Valdeseri, and I'm here with Ambassador Deborah Burks, who is the Global AIDS Coordinator and oversees PEPFAR. Debbie, I wonder, as the person who does oversee the PEPFAR program, if you can share with our audience what your priorities are for PEPFAR. Well, thank you. It's, I've been very fortunate to be part of PEPFAR from the beginning in a series of different roles. And I'm, it's, I get to come in on a program that's really been solidly built by Ambassador Diebel and Ambassador Goosby. And it's, it's been a program that, although begun in the Bush administration, has been strongly supported and expanded under the President Obama and strongly supported by every Secretary of State. So it's been a great privilege yes. to come into this position. I mean, that's quite a track record. It is an amazing track record yeah. and, and bipartisan support in Congress and the, really the American people's support to translate their taxpayer dollars into this life-saving program. I think my real focus is to build on that legacy and bring impact analyses, accountability, and transparency to the program in a new and more open way. So we're really working on demonstrating the impact that this program had. We started with a program that was very much focused on saving lives. It was an emergency, and mm -hmm. it was an important time, and many people were dying around the world in resource-limited settings. So we were focused on saving lives, and on the way of saving lives, we noticed that we began to have an impact on the epidemic. Till now, when UNAIDS is calling for, for the end of the AIDS epidemic as we know it. I mean, that's amazing to think about that. It's for, amazing. And I know you've been involved in AIDS since day one. And who it's would have amazing. thought we'd be at that point? It's amazing. So I think, and President Obama calling for an AIDS-free generation, we have our goals set. And I think figuring out how to measure impacts so that everyone understands that we're changing the actual trajectory of the pandemic now through this strong program. In collaboration, of course, with the Global Fund and the host countries. And that comes to the accountability piece. We have to make sure that we have our information available to the American public, so if you go to PEP fire.gov right now and go under data and results you'll see all of our budget over time over the last 11 years and all of our results by country by budget type by prevention of mother to child transmission by adult treatment by pediatric treatment so the american people can follow along with us and people around the globe can see the impact of this program and so we're calling for this higher level of really transparency joined with accountability Great. and i know as a public health professional you're committed to having programs that work, but as a public servant, you also understand that we have to be very transparent with that information. So we congratulate you. Thank you. Um, you're doing a great job on behalf, not just of the American public, but all of the peoples that are being served by PEPFAR. This is Dr. Ron Valdeseri for AIDS.gov.